UTIs or urinary tract infections are not just uncomfortable and inconvenient, they can actually be deadly. Thousands of people die in the United States each year and millions head to the doctor or the emergency room because of these painful infections. But there's new hope for those who suffer from frequent UTIs. It's an unusual vaccine. Jen Pachano reports patients are already lining up for relief. 50% of women will get a UTI in their lifetime. It's a horrible feeling because you feel the urgency that you have to go to the bathroom. Mm -hmm. And then when you go, it's very painful. It, it burns. Many, like Yolanda Curry, suffer from frequent or recurring UTIs. I have two to three a year. These patients often end up at urgent cares and ERs desperate for relief and treatment. And then they're at an increased risk of another UTI right after that treatment just because of the way our immune system deals with a bacterial infection in the bladder. Dr. Rachel Pope is a gynecologist at the Urology Institute at University Hospitals. She says older patients during or after menopause are at a particularly higher risk because of the lack of estrogen to help fight off infections. Especially in assisted living facilities, elderly patients, they're not necessarily getting that burning sensation or these classic symptoms of urinary tract infection. Sometimes it's showing up as delirium, as confusion, as mental status changes, and they very well might end up in the hospital until a UTI is actually diagnosed. In the U.S., we see 10 and a half million doctor's visits and 3 million ER visits each year because of UTIs. Patients can even become septic and die if these infections aren't caught and treated. There's also a societal cost in terms of missing work, with an estimated $3.5 billion worth of loss in productivity. But a new vaccine is giving patients like Yolanda hope for relief. Uramune targets four of the most common bacteria known to cause UTIs. It's an inactivated or killed vaccine, which is similar to vaccinations currently used for hepatitis A and the seasonal flu. The vaccine is not yet FDA approved or available to patients, but it has been proven effective in an FDA phase three clinical trial. Dr. Pope says introducing this vaccine to her patients would be huge. What they found from research is after the first year of taking it, it reduced the number of infections by 70%. So that's massive for a woman who's getting six to 10 urinary tract infections a year. The efficacy numbers lessen after the first 12 months, but are still at about 30%. But this isn't a push up your sleeves kind of vaccine. It's pretty unusual. Patients will have to spray the pineapple flavored vaccine under their tongue every day for 90 days. Well, it's intense, but I think this patient population is motivated. Um, they really want to do anything to avoid that next urinary tract infection. Anything's better than having pain because throughout my life having these bladder infections, it's interfered with me at work. Dr. Pope says there's not a lot of data out there yet detailing how much the efficacy drops off if a patient skips doses. But those who are using it are seeing their immune system's memory triggered to remember the bacteria that are coming back and successfully fighting it off. She says once it's available, she'll be recommending it to her patients with frequent UTIs as a way to keep them off of so many antibiotics. I mentioned to my doctor, let me be the first patient. I'm that enthusiastic. Wow, I believe this is a great breakthrough for women. Yolanda is confident this vaccine will improve her quality of life and looks forward to enjoying things others who don't suffer from frequent UTIs take for granted like plane rides. And I always make, made sure that I get my seats right in the back next to the bathroom, so now I can sit up in the front and enjoy the ride. <laughs> Jen Pachano, 19 News.